hello friends this is Sarfraz from mycomputerplanet.com and today uh, I'm going to show you how you can use data if function in Microsoft Excel for yourself um, basically we use this function uh, if you want to calculate uh, the number of years between two days or uh, number of months between two days or uh, number of days between two days so all these things you can do with if function uh, in Microsoft Excel. Uh, one more thing I would like to uh, tell you here is that uh, dated if function is not available by default in Windows uh, Excel, sorry, uh, Microsoft Excel to function like if I uh, I'm going to write here any like if we do if we need dated if, sorry, just uh, some average as uh, we can just, you know, use it here. Uh, insert function so you won't find anywhere here the stated if function so how to use that uh, today I'm going to show you that so let's start with the new worksheet <coughs> uh, friends suppose I have a date here uh, mm. let me let's say it's 7 3 uh, this is my first date and the second is set 7 3 one three. Uh, this is second date. And now I want to calculate the number of years, number of days, and number of months between two uh, days. So how you can do that? Uh, let me just uh, maybe write it here. This is calculate as the number of years, the number of months, this number of days. So syntax of this function actually is uh, uh, it's just like you need to press equals then dated if bracket then a1 this is the cell at the top this day 73 1977 second a2 the cell address of a is 732013 comma if you want to calculate the year then you will need to type uh, y and close the breaker and it can it will calculate you the number of years between the two days. So similarly you can use data a one a two the cell address and we are choosing this time uh, months number of months just press it so it will tell the four and thirty two months between two days and data f a one a two and D for days, so it will calculate the number of days between these two days. You can basically write all these three in a single uh, line. So, how to do that? Just write dated if A1, A2 plus years and years. Then again, dated if a1, a2, a1, a2, the cell address of these two dates. Okay. Then m for months and months. And dated if a1, a2, and days. And so this is the syntax. So it has actually calculated the same thing, but on a single, uh, you know, uh, on a, uh, a single line, you can uh, actually calculate it like this: for just 36 years, 432 months, and 13,149 days. So just try it and use it. So this was all about JTD function in Microsoft Excel. I hope you like this tutorial. Do subscribe and do visit my website www.mycomputerplanet.com. Thank you so much. Thanks a lot.